Hello and welcome back to my channel. We are continuing my Build a City challenge in Haven Rock uh, with Victoria's next episode, Victoria in Winter. Uh, she is our baker. We're going to be maintaining the bakery, selling some more tasty goods to the town of Haven Rock. Uh, and yeah, I'm sure there'll be more excitement for Victoria this round as well. So let's hop in and see how she's getting on. So here is Victoria in her very nice house. Uh, this was originally Monica's, now it's hers, and she's added the bakery at the back of the lot. Uh, this was her special build to be able to sell her baked goods. Uh, rather than having to buy a separate kitchen or bake enough to carry into town, I thought a little home bakery would be the best idea. So Victoria is a popularity sim. She has fallen in love with Leo, but I've been thinking about this, and I'm not sure if I'm going to let them move in, because I do find that... It, when Sims have two businesses, I struggle to run both of them, especially if they're going to have kids, things like that. One of them will run by the, will fall by the wayside. And the bakery and the pub are both important to me in terms of the rounds. And uh, the options we have for Haven Rock, these were kind of the things I envisioned when I started out. So I'm going to not pursue Leo. Obviously, ACR will have its own plans. It has done this round <laughs> very, very strongly. But I'm not going to actively try and get them to move in together or get married. We're just going to let that, unless they both roll a want or, you know, we'll just, we'll, assess then uh, but my plan is not to try and get them together uh, permanently so victoria has some business to take care of this morning and then we'll check our, our stocks she has two oh she's oh she's bought some good things she's adding some decoration to her home very nice and she also, also has a tv which makes her um, the second person in town i think to have one and then this guitar doesn't sell very well when it turns out it just goes into the stand so we'll we'll just get rid of that she has two croissants but that's probably not going to be enough for uh, a full day let's get some food and then um, yeah let's make some extra things for her not open yet Oscar come back in a moment might do a little bit of morning baking Oh, clearly it's popular. People are trying to get in there. They want this loaf of bread in particular. Okay, it's time to start selling some baked goods. Now we can restock the fridge. And so she's ranked one at the moment. This might be a struggle to get higher. We can add some more items, I think. Uh, and there's two more stars to get to the next rank. Hi, Alan. Let's help out Jenny. Oh, well, there we go. Rank two straight away. So we already took wholesale discounts, so we'll take a little bit of cash. Grabbing those extra thousand simoleons. And rank two. Excellent work, Victoria. Oh, Leo's arrived. <laughs> we we're just talking about you. Leo, you're going to have to move. <laughs> you're causing some problems. There we go. Lucky that didn't seem to count as being in the queue. Oh, everyone just sort of faff around. Oh, there's some rooting problems here. Mm -mm -mm. There we go. Finally. Oh, well, it's made Jenny think more about getting some extra pastries. Fair enough. And Leo too has gone back for more. I'll just move that down a little bit <laughs> so they've got a bit more space. Right, let's answer the phone. Who's calling? Oh, it's Eloise. Oh, excellent. So no time to chat. It's still bakery hour. Oh, 
Oh, no. Oh, she came the star right back. It's fine. Oh, Leo's fuming. Oh, excellent. She got a badge for that, so that's excellent news. <laughs> oh, hello, Monica. Oh, the joy of a TV. <laughs> Just hang out with Monica and watch some television. What a luxury on this island. Whilst the clientele just kind of lurks around the back garden. That's fine. Oh, have I just... Terrible at lights. No wonder everyone's bills are so low. <laughs> There's literally no light in any houses. Hang out with Monica a little bit. Okay, it's getting a bit late. That's quite a lot of uh, rock paper scissors. Victoria needs some food and then some sleep. I guess I'd hang out with Monica. Who's going to watch her eat a hamburger? <laughs> so it's a windy day today, an excellent day for making cakes, I think. I'm going to add some extra stock today as well. She's got a bit of spare cash. And I think it would just be nice to have some more things uh, to be able to sell in this lot. Uh, particularly birthday cakes, is what I'm thinking. If we can sell those. Oh, excellent. She's got a bronze stocking badge. She is flying and doing all in her pyjamas. Okay, so some slightly more stocked shelves. I've added in some more decorative uh, food items, some extra bread and some decorative tins. Birthday cakes and some more, just some more baskets of bread, as much as we can, as we can stock. So let's get her ready for the day. And uh, have a fairly leisurely opening time after breakfast. I have just realised it's Sunday, so that was my mistake. So the bakery won't be opening today. That is fine. I want to serve some food. Why not? Something actually was sent her out uh, to the pub for some entertainment. And maybe she'll meet a new sim. Obviously Leo is there, so there is a risk there, but you know. Who doesn't like going to the pub on a Sunday afternoon in a hail of blizzard? <laughs> Maybe we should meet somebody new. Let's just sign in and play some darts. Go away today entertained. Oh, and here's Maya. She escaped the inferno at the uh, Big Brother house. Oh, Gerd's here. Gerd, the reviewer. My own cast I'm in a chair, so that's very nice. <laughs> try and flirt with Leo, but he's quite busy with Carson and with Maya. She might not be able to uh, get in there. Oh, she met Isabel, who may very well be becoming a, um, a playable. Compliment her on surviving. I'm probably getting to have a uh, a fancy home. Oh, excellent! We get a discount from Isabel, who definitely doesn't own a furniture shop. But you never know. And Lena should be here, but we'll just ignore her. It's very getting a good reputation. Excellent to see, and just being kept from uh, from Leo <laughs> by. Pure chance. <laughs> we can get a drink with uh, with Isabel. Oh. And Monica's here. She wants to be best friends with Monica, so that could be a nice thing to pursue. 
Oh, we have Conrad. He's a new sim. Uh, to Victoria, anyway. We just interrupt him trying to give uh, any money to Leo. I'll tell you what, come here, Victoria. Let's try a standard room scope. Obviously, I mean, she's right next to Leo. That's maybe not great. Oh. Also Rahul, though. We're going to ignore Leo for now. Let's say hi to Rahul. He also lit up with the glow of attraction. We'll let him sign in. Oh, two bolts with Rahul. Okay. It's a bit more like it. Let's see how we get on with Rahul today. Hang out in the pub. Oh, he's not. He's not feeling it. Fair enough. <laughs> he was like this in the uh, the Big Brother challenge. He just would not talk to anyone. Ah, oh, path's blocked by that chair. We'll fix that next time. We're here. <laughs> Who does she like? She doesn't like Comrade. Well, fair enough. Well, that was a good trip out to the pub. It's almost half eleven, so I'll send her home. And uh, that's a good night of entertainment. So back from a rowdy night at the pub. <laughs> it's time for Victoria to do some chores and get herself into bed for a bright and early Monday morning. So it is a fresh Monday morning. Oh, and she's going to make a booty call to Leo. Well, <laughs> that's one way to start the week off. Let's keep things exciting. We'll see how this goes. <laughs> I'm trusting you, Victoria. Okay, there were no baby chimes. So that's something. So after a bit of cleaning, going to let her open up the bakery. Yeah, you can hang out if you want to, but you're not really trapped there, I don't think. Just whinging. Let's open the bakery with a new and improved stock. Uh, oh, let's answer the phone first, and then open the bakery. Oh, it's Maya. That's nice. Victoria making some extra friends. The new bakery tray is proving popular already. And you hope thinking about a birthday cake. So we'll let her sell for a bit longer. Oh, that was a good one. Thank you, Freddy. And I'm thinking for this evening, she needs to study up her cooking. She needs to have more options for things to cook. So we're going to do that. Just get her skilled up a bit more, I think. So we can fill these fridges with some more fun stuff. <laughs> okay, that'll be time to close. We'll see if anyone else has anything to buy. And then she can hit the books. Ah, oh, thank you, Matthew. And Rahul, he was here. Fantastic. And Toby. And of course, Toby is, I think, pretty much promised to Eloise at this point. I think he might be a good match for her uh, going forwards. But we'll get to Eloise when we get there. Okay, let's serve some dinner. Let's have, what's her highest level? Let's make some fried chicken. And then once she's fed, she can study. Well, there we go. Already got that skill points. Thank you, Victoria. So what can she make now? Let's have a look at the desserts. Oh, she can make crepe Suzette. She can make some sparkly pancakes. That'll be fun. Oh, you might as well clean up, Victoria. Okay, she make a rainbow cake. 
could be quite nice. Cinnamon rolls, but they're not. Um, you just pulled them out of the uh, out of the oven. There's not much skill there, so I'll just let her study a bit more. She can get a little bit more skilled up before bed. Okay, at midnight, I think she can take a break and head to bed. So up bright and early to get started on some cleaning, and then once she's had breakfast up a grilled cheese of course she's going to make some food I think make some uh, can she make single servings of crepes is it? she make some group meals oh she also does have a uh, aspiration point she can use yeah, I'm thinking maybe slower need decay on let's do fun and hunger let's do the main branch because she is struggling with those. I, all the sims do. <laughs> oh, filthy conditions. Just make two of those. And then I'll watch TV for a bit to boost her fun. And sort out the um, the inventory, the stock in the shop. So there we go. I've got a plate of crepes is out. Uh, ready to sell. Still steaming hot. Fresh from Victoria's oven. Oh, a bit of sports. Is that her uh, one true hobby? No, we haven't uncovered it yet. Interesting. Okay, the snows have melted. I think it's time to open up. We'll sell to the mayor. Oh, thank you, Portia. You've taken us to rank three. And because uh, it's a... It's less about the items, they're quite cheap anyway. I'm going to go straight for the next level of funds. Take it up to four grand. Very nice. Oh, you're lost in here, Blake. There's no... Oh, it's Rahul. Fantastic. <laughs> Everyone's come to hang out in her living room. I'm going to let her talk to Rahul, but actually Blake does need help. He's lost the cookies. They're not in this building, Blake. They're, they're next door. Ah, more stars. And bring up these customers. Oh, Blake's a fan of uh, of Victoria. Two bolts. Quite good. Victoria's very distracted today. She's not really in the mood for... Have I made that for sale? So I know. Yes, I have. Yeah, she's very distracted from uh, from the bakery today. Maybe she wants to do some other things. Oh, so I set the counter for sale, apparently. <laughs> Thanks, Blake, for buying the counter. Oh, series come round in a new outfit. Hi, Peter. You need a help? Hmm. Actually, five more stars to get to the next level. And everyone's apparently needing help, which is very, very helpful for stacking up those stars. Let's check the house. <laughs> oh, Matthew's wandered in and is also confused. Stock's getting a bit low, Matthew. We can certainly try and help. Oh, just two more stars. I'm getting carried away. Let's close up, ring up our customers, and think about something fun for the evening. Nope, nobody's ring up. Excellent. Uh oh. Go, ring up these two. It's okay, Peter, calm down. It's okay. Victoria, you're being distracted. 
Well, next time she only needs two stars and she'll be uh, getting her promotion, which well, getting her next level, which is very, very good. I'm going to invite Rahul round and see how they get on. Just come round to ours. And he's coming right over. Excellent. I think Victoria deserves some downtime, some relaxation. And let's see what we want. So he's also a popularity sim, which is very helpful. Let's try some uh, entertaining jokes. Joking about how he escaped from the prison of the Big Brother house. We'll serve some salad for a nice evening meal. In the middle of winter. <laughs> Who doesn't love a salad? Oh no, there's no food. Okay, I'll just get some leftovers. Oh actually, why don't you serve a platter? Does that take... That's just free food. Try a bit of play, a few interactions. Open some flirting and Rahul wants to make out. So. But there is sports. Oh Rahul, are you going to leap? Go for it. <laughs> A trust leap. And it paid off. Soft kiss to start out with. And of course they're popularity sims. They both immediately want to meet someone new. Ah, got to go outside for a back rub. Maximum space. Where, where are you going? To the shop? To the garden? By the bins, of course. The best place to give a back rub. I like he wants to be flirted with. He doesn't want to do the flirting. <laughs> He's not doing the heavy lifting. Ah, they got crushes. Well, that's cute. Well, they're going to play some football, so instead they're going to end the date. Yeah, we'll end the date and let Victoria uh, head to bed. That will take care of some needs, which is good. So it'll be too dire for the next day. That might be the first time ACR hasn't interfered. <laughs> so the late night, she's had a slight lie-in, not nothing too crazy. Uh, and as the winds howl, I'm going to send her out to the um, to the mini mart. She needs some food, needs some stocks to be able to make more more pastries. So we'll send her out and uh, go and see Eloise. So Eloise is here. There's food here as well, which is nice. Fully stocked. No time to make a snowman, Victoria. This is a working day. You might be getting to rank four, I think, of the business today. If you can get some more stock in. Victoria. <laughs> okay, we'll take everything she has and pay for it. Ah, oh, I hear my two almost identical sims. <laughs> Isabel and Eloise. So she can have some food and then we can start restocking and uh, getting ready for the day. Did we sell the crepes that we did? So we should make more of those. Okay, with that all sorted, let's get restocking. We'll open just in time for lunch. Just after lunch. <laughs> and we'll turn that cabinet off being for sale. <laughs> I'm sure that was making made us some good money, but we're not selling the furniture. Okay, excellent. Everything restocked. We're ready to go. For the last day of business for Victoria. Come on, Maya, come buy some tins or some bread, anything you like. Make sure the house is okay while we're here. 
Gonna have a huge amount of flies. Did someone get lost? Oh, it's Gerd, the reviewer. Gonna be nice to her. <gasps> we got rank four. It happens, and we're gonna we're gonna take more money. <laughs> Just because uh, we're gonna thirteen thousand volumes now, Victoria. That is fantastic. Okay, let's ring up Gerd. Let's see if we get that good review, which would be the icing on top. Oh, Joe. Just like to lose stars at businesses. And then regain them. Only at Victoria's though. Oh, Oscar and Zoya here, being very cute in the corner. Okay, and as it gets dark, I think it's time to close up for the day and for the season. We'll be the cashier. Uh -huh. Just for Harrison, who's certainly not here in real life. I'm going to call uh, Rahul and get him over. And we can make some food. I know, Victoria, it's been a tough couple of days. Let's watch some TV. Oh, loves the weather. Can we make a prawn curry? I'm sure this won't catch fire. Oh, excellent, a new skill point. Perfect. What could she cook now? Oh, berry pie. Excellent. That is really good. Rahul, this is for you. <laughs> Not into it. Oh, that's okay. I want to be best friends, so I'm going to try and get that to happen. I have a pillow fight. Help out your fun. Oh, there we go. I've unlocked make outs. Finally. Ah, best friends. There we go. And now watch some TV for fun. You can have some, Rahul. You can take some food if you want it. Well, what does he want to do? Hug romantically. And then why not take it to the bedroom before we end this season? <laughs> or not, Rahul is maybe the most or the least romantically inclined sim in the neighbourhood so far. ACR has not even touched him. Um, uh, it's quite cool, quite nice to have different kinds of sims. And that has taken us to spring. It is now the end of Victoria's winter rotation. She survived winter, her curry's gone rotten, but her business is flying. We can probably think about increasing in the prices or the um, products, maybe some more uh, uh, fridge cabinets for next time. But in the meantime, Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode and uh, I will see you back next time when I think we're moving on to Eloise as we go around the, uh, around the corner. So thank you again so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.